everyone. Today we are going to briefly show you how we ship shoes for Poshmark. Shoes that do not have their own shoe box. Because let's face it, they don't always have a shoe box. My name is Karen. And I'm Jay. And we're with the Thrifty Flamingo. We talk a lot about Poshmark and reselling in general. So if you're interested in this content, we would really appreciate if you subscribe to our channel. Yeah, so how do you protect the shoe and how do you properly ship a shoe when it does not have a shoe box? These are Sewer Weitzman shoes that are very expensive, so we don't really want these getting damaged in shipping. I'm gonna go show you exactly how. So I'm gonna show you how to package shoes for Poshmark for shipment that don't already have a shoe box and what are the best boxes to ship them out in right this way so when we put our shoes into inventory i took these out just for you guys um, we wrap them and put them in a bag put our inventory label on them we wrap them individually if they're going to rub on each other these ones are suede so i didn't want them rubbing if it's a canvas sneaker or something they'll just go in the bag with a label on it so i took these out to show you guys exactly how i do it we use smaller tissue paper when we need to separate. Get them at the dollar store. You get like 35 sheets for a dollar. So you'll notice they're like smaller than normal ones. And then my favorite bread bags from Walmart. So you just take it. This one, you don't really need to do the sandal ones, but I'll do it for demonstration purposes. It doesn't have to be perfect. Get it in there. <laughs> Back in nice. The bag protects them from water damage in case you know it's left outside in the rain or something like that. Protects your item. So usually I would just pull, you know, whatever shoes it is, and it would end up like that. So there's been a lot of questions lately about how the Poshmark website says you can only ship flat, um, regular priority mail, not flat rate. I'm going to link below a link showing that you can use flat rate and regional boxes. I don't know why they didn't upgrade their website. I'm not sure their FAQs. So right over here, the best boxes, if you don't have a shoe box for shoes, are the regional rate A box. And the medium rate flat rate box that is not like that's more of the cube this one right here now on ebay ebay we're used to shoving our shoes in here if it fits in here we're happy this is the cheapest way to ship shoes on ebay but poshmark's a little bit more posh than that i do not use these for poshmark shoes even though it is a flat rate so with my shoes right here that i just wrapped it would fit pretty snugly in the regional rate box no need to stuff it it's not going to shake around i would wrap it as i usually do they look like that you order them online i'll also put a link in the description for those now if you have bigger shoes and or high heels like my suede jeffrey campbell shoes they fit perfectly in the medium box so um, these are my preferable shoe boxes when I do not have a shoe box. They are perfect. And yes, Poshmark allows flat rate and regional rate boxes. So now that you see how we ship our shoes, it's really quite simple. You can use just about any box right now with Poshmark, and you're going to link that below to show yep, them. Yep, I'm going to give you the exact boxes I use. Because I know the information from Poshmark on the app is a little different to what we actually can they to what they put out. Yeah, they didn't update the app yet. No. So. It's very simple. Any box, any um, any box that will fit a pair of shoes. Just so. not express. That's the only one forbidden. Right. So if you're interested in learning more about shoes, we have an awesome uh, ebook that is available now. It's called 101 Killer Shoes, and uh, you can you can grab that book. There's a link in the description below. It's by Tino, the Soul Advisor, and Steve Rakin. They put a lot of work into this into this book. It'll show you a ton of great women's shoes that you can pick up and sell for maximum profit. So definitely check that out. It's going to be in the description. And um, just I click read that it. link. Yeah. <laughs> I was like not wanting to put it down. <laughs> <laughs> so it's definitely good. Knowledge is power. You know, bring in some more money. Learn which shoes are great. 
I really hope you guys have learned. If you have, give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't already, we would also appreciate if you subscribe to our channel. Happy poshing, guys. Have a good one.